Tonight at 10 o'clock, we have a live report from a house explosion in Beloit. Good evening, everybody. I'm Jennifer Hoff. Two people were inside when that home exploded on Meredith Drive tonight. The Beloit Fire Department has confirmed that multiple fire departments were called in to help with the fire and rescue. Our own Theo Keith is live in Beloit tonight, and he has the very latest on this. Theo? Jen, an incredible emergency response here tonight. At least a dozen fire trucks. Crews have just pulled at least one dog out of the rubble. Before that, they rescued both adult victims, a male and a female. Both were alive when they were rescued. Dozens of firefighters now waiting around on this very warm night. This home completely leveled, the fire chief said, and you can see it in some of the video. First responding officers tonight said that they definitely smelled gas when they approached this home. Have a listen to what the emergency response was after that. Uh, it's a tedious, slow process. It takes uh, a long time to get it done. Uh, we have to dig, brace the area, uh, reinforce the area so it doesn't collapse on the rescuer, and then dig some more. So We were here tonight as crews put the second victim, the man, on a stretcher and wheeled him down the street. The street, Meredith Drive, is completely blocked right now by emergency response vehicles. Neighbors at one point were told that they could not get back into their homes because of concerns about gas and uh, other problems on this street. We have seen some of them starting to come back, though. We were told that at least part of the street was evacuated for a time because of concerns about a gas leak and a possible second explosion. We never heard one, and we haven't heard any further updates about that. Uh, so those neighbors are starting to trickle back in. Again, just to recap, both victims were alive when they were taken out of the home. Two victims after a home explosion in Beloit. We will have many further updates as they become available on Channel3000.com and also News 3 this morning. For now, Jen, back to you. At the presence down there, Theo Keith reporting live in Beloit tonight at that house explosion. Thank you very much. And like Theo said, we'll of course bring you any updates on this story throughout the newscast as well as Channel3000.com. And of course, there is News 3 this morning, and they will also have the latest on this developing story.